for the cast of Addie and Uno. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for being here. Are you guys so excited? Clap if you're happy to be here. Yay! I have to clap because I'm so happy to be here. Did you guys like that number? Was it fun? Do you know, want me to tell you something super cool about being here at Google? The person who wrote that song actually works for Google, and she's right here right now, Bonnie Gleischer. <laughs> How awesome is that? Got a celebrity <laughs> in the building. Isn't that amazing? So parents, if you want to come bring the kids to the show, see Bonnie. She'll take care of us. <laughs> yeah. um, so as you just saw in the number, Addie signs up Uno for the Math Mania competition because she wants, first off, she wants him to get over his fears and, and accomplish things, but she also wants a red, shiny new bike. Do you guys like bikes? Clap if you like bikes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, and I love bikes. I also love puppets. Do you, clap if you love puppets, because I love puppets. <laughs> you know what else I love? I love jokes. Clap if you like jokes. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm going to tell you one. I'm going to tell you one, okay? What do you call a broken pencil? Hmm. Pointless! <laughs> <laughs> okay, well... As we've just said, we're here at Addie and Uno. I am Tom. I'm the producer of this show. And with me right now is one of my very best friends, Anastasia. And I'm uh, 
uh, the consulting producer on the show. And one of the reasons why I think a show like this is so important and one of the reasons why I would love it if all of you guys tell all your friends and all your friends' families and come see the show is because when I was little, like you guys, I didn't have characters on the stage or on television or in the movies that look like me. And I think it's really great that this show allows kids who are like me to see themselves on the stage, but it also teaches all of us about how important kindness is. And that's a message that we think everybody should learn and help us to spread. Yes. Yeah. Big and little kids alike, kindness <laughs> makes a difference. Yeah. So we're going to do another song for you at this moment of the show. As Addie told you earlier, RJ, he loves science and he loves rockets. And he just built the most amazing rocket, which makes me think of another joke. Why did the cow get on the rocket ship? I know. You want, you want to tell it? You can do it. <laughs> he wanted to go to the moon. Because oh, yeah! he wanted to go to the moon! Yes! Yeah! All right, we're going to hire you for the next show. <laughs> he, he delivers that better Perfect. than me. Yeah. But yeah. unfortunately, it doesn't stay super fun because... The bullies take RJ's rocket from him, and they break it. And I bet you, you know, we've all had a time where someone's picked on us or a bully's been mean, and we know that is no fun, and it is absolutely the wrong thing to do. So RJ's friends try to lift his spirits, and RJ, through the next song, lets us all know that no matter what, he's not going to give up on his dreams, and he can achieve anything. And this is your favorite song on the show, right, Anastasia? It's my favorite song in the show because... When I was little, I actually did think I could fly in, in my wheelchair. And I love that RJ thinks that too, and I'm really excited for you to see it. This song is called Watch Me Fly. Take it, RJ. Woo! The easiest thing to do is give up and give in the hardest thing to do is stay strong and win but i just know i'm never letting go of my dream though people like to say i'm too weak i'm too small there's too much in my way i'll miss i'll fall but i just know i'm stronger than i I seem Cause I got wings on my back Fuel in my heart There are mountains to see Clouds left apart I've got friends on the ride I know I'll reach the sky Watch me fly Watch me fly From morning to the night, I'll work with the pieces. Build it till it's right, then test it, release it. Cause I just know I'm getting closer to my dream. And no one will tell me what to do. And no one will tell me what to say. Watch me rise and zoom away, away. Cause I got wings on my back, fuel in my heart. There are mountains to see, clouds left apart. I got friends on the ride. I know I'll reach the sky. FBR, Frida Kahlo, they defied their fate. And every time I see a star shoot across the sky, I look at it and think if they can, why can't?
watch me fly. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Thank you. That was beautiful. That was so wonderful. Do you guys like rockets? Clap if you like rockets. Yeah. <laughs> Not going to spoil it, but RJ does get a new beautiful rocket, and it's painted gold. So cool. Oh, look at, whoa, you have a rocket. That's an amazing that looks just rocket. Like mine. That's awesome. Wow. Well, we're going to do one more song for you guys. Okay, and fine, I'll do one more joke. How do you get a Kleenex to dance? Put a little boogie into it. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. You're like, come on. Yo, yo. Oh. Okay. So, our last song today, Uno really wants to compete in Math Mania, but he's still so afraid, and he's very afraid that the bullies are going to tease him. So his friends get behind him and tell him that no matter what he decides, that they'll still be friends and everything is still going to be okay because no matter what happens, you can count on your friends. Take it, guys and girls. Yeah. <laughs> Uno, everyone here is your friend. Friends will love you no matter what. It's a big decision, there is no denying Oh, it can feel like much too much Uh-huh, but you have got the talent What's the harm in trying? You have got the Midas touch Oh, I don't know Oh, you're the best and the brightest, strong and the rightest Always getting an A You're the toughest equation, genius invasion Always ready to slay <laughs> Make a mistake or fail, they're gonna point and laugh. And then what? <sighs> We've all got our bullies. They're a huge distraction. Cowards who are insecure. So insecure, so insecure. But even they have limitations. Add them up like computations. It's the truth you can't ignore. Oh, oh you're, you're the, the tough and the smartest, nearly an artist. Numbers are colors you paint. You're, you're a cool calculator, short sure formulator. Always ahead. So think it over. The crowd is watching and the bullies are so there. So think it over. But I'm not afraid. So, so think it over. And it's our turn. So, so think it over. We're given the question. So, so think it over. Oh, it looks hard. So, so think it over. But I think I know it. You think you know it? a big decision there is no denying i'm ready yay uno he's ready <laughs> wow that was so much fun i want to introduce you all of you to one more person that you didn't really hear from um you heard from the amazing mathematician uno the hilarious cc <laughs> The brilliant Addy, RJ is amazing rockets, the songstress Melody. But we have another friend that goes to school with us named Kelsey, who's new at the school. She is also, like Cece, she's also hearing impaired. And she knows how to do some of the coolest things. And she loves her new school. And she's going to tell you why real quick. 
So I love my new friends because we all count on each other. So can I teach you something in sign language today? Yeah! In sign language? So I'm going to teach you how to say you can count on friends. So if you want to repeat after awesome. me, we'll learn, I okay? Do it. Yeah. You. You. Can. Can. Count. Count. count on. On. Friends. Friends. Do you want to put it together? Yeah. Yes. You. you can. can Count on friends. Faster. Let's do it. Okay. You can count on friends. Great job. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Whoa. Thank you, Kelsey. Yeah. That was so awesome. And, so <laughs> <clears throat> and thank you all so much. Did you have fun? Yeah. Thank you. How much fun? Did you have so much fun? Yeah. Okay, one more joke. Oh, wow. One more joke, one more joke. Brother. What do you call a cheese that isn't yours? Hmm. Nacho cheese. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's not your cheese. Yeah, it's, like, it's cheese, but it's not your like nacho. Oh, that's the joke. <laughs> yeah, well, do you want to come up and tell me? Oh, cool. Yeah. What's your joke? Yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. I was using the stuff. Yes. Woohoo. Yes, good job. All right. Poop in the toilet. <laughs> what is a poop in the toilet? <laughs> couple of seconds we're going to ask questions so in the next minute or so think of a question and I'll come out with an <laughs> elegant microphone and we can ask questions and the cast and Anastasia and even I will answer some and then we'll take pictures with the cast but first we just want to thank you all do you have a joke for me all right think about it in one minute we're going to knock it out of the park okay <laughs> yes <laughs> but thank you so much to all the amazing people at Google I love Google I Google myself daily <laughs> <laughs> so, do too. so it's pretty great. Uh, and the amazing Bonnie who brought us here and wrote Thanks, this beautiful Bonnie. Music. Bonnie. She's not yeah. here, but uh, Dr. Navasilton uh, wrote the play, and she's wonderful, but she's at home with the beautiful new baby. Yeah. Um, and thank you to the, our beautiful cast and all of you amazing people. If you liked what you saw, and I hope you did, um, please come see us. We play at Theater Row on West 42nd Street every Saturday at noon. You can go to www.addyanduno.com for all the information on tickets and everything. And kids, just this once, I give you permission to totally nag your parents to make them bring you. <laughs> like you totally should. Do it. Just, mm -hmm. you know, um, but please come and please tell all your friends because it really is a beautiful show. And I promise kindness makes a difference. And everybody that comes in and sees this show, they leave knowing that different is special and that everyone is beautiful no matter what. And you can count on friends. And you want to add anything, Anastasia? Because um, you know once you give me a mic, I don't stop. <laughs> you did a great job. We want all of, <laughs> we want all of the kids to all of you to talk to your friends and all of your parents to talk to have them talk to their friends and tell them to come see the show because we need help to keep it open and we can't do that if we don't have people to come see the show. We are also to uh, get the community involved to help us keep playing the show. We started a GoFundMe. Oh, that is true. So if you'd like more information about the GoFundMe page, you can reach out to us through adianuda.com and we'd be happy to tell you what you can do to help us yes. fundraise and keep the show open as long as we can. So, and, and the goal of the page is so we can cut ticket prices to not so we can become not only the most groundbreaking family show in New York, but the most affordable because the families who need to see this most are being priced out of it. And we're going to, uh, through the GoFundMe, create a campaign that puts a block of sponsored tickets on our website every week. So no matter what, Every family and every child can see Addie and Uno. So if you want to check it out and tell your friends, we'd love it because we want everyone to see this. And we also want to, we've had a lot of people approach us about bringing it to the board event, but again, it's an issue of funding. A lot of schools want to bring it to their schools and have it be we'll a part, but, but can. they can't afford it. So if, if we're able to raise the money, then we can we're also, we'll go everywhere. we can tour the schools as well, which would be really great. All right, now it's a fun time. Any question you like, 
I'll even tell more jokes if you ask. <laughs> and you've been waiting so patiently. We're going to yeah. start with you. I'm going to get right down here because you're a little taller than me. <laughs> what do you got for me? Why didn't the skeleton go the dance? Why didn't the... Why did the skeleton... Why didn't the skeleton burp? Why didn't the skeleton burp? Because he didn't have the guts to fart with. Oh, he didn't have the guts to fart with. Oh, that was epic. High five. Amazing joke. So does anyone have any questions? Raise your hand and I will, I will run over to you. You have another joke? All right, why not? What did the pirate say when he stuck his wooden leg in the freezer? What did the pirate say when he stuck his wooden leg in the freezer? Go. Shiver me timbers. Oh, shiver me timbers. <laughs> Hilarious. You're hired. Good job. Okay, does anyone have any questions about the puppets, about the show, about, about Addy and Uno, about anything to do with performing? We're, 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 believe it or not, we're super professional. <laughs> what, would you have a question? Remember, all the puppets can answer your question. The puppets so. can answer your question. The actor can answer your question. Yes, I'm on my way. <laughs> Do you have a question? You what can tell. What happened to Uno? What? What happened, what happened to Uno? Uno? Oh, okay. So what happened to Uno once he uh, <clears throat> entered the competition? Uh, well, you're gonna have to come see the play <laughs> to find out. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to give away the ending. We can't tell you if he wins. But hey, hey, doing it. Spoiler. But we like happy ending. I was gonna say. Endings. I was gonna say. Give away the ending, but we can say that Uno is super brave. <laughs> he yeah. is. We love Uno. Oh, I oh. Okay, you can. Yeah, we love jokes. Laughter is the music of the soul. <laughs> Why did the chicken cross cross the road? Why did that chicken cross the road? Because it needed to get eggs. Because it needed to get eggs. <laughs> Twist on an old knock classic. knock. <laughs> Banana. Banana who? Knock knock. Who's there? Banana. Banana who? Knock knock. Who's there? Orange. Oh, thank goodness. Orange who? Aren't you glad I didn't say banana? I am glad! Yes! That's I'm so classic. glad you didn't say banana because I was like, why does he keep saying banana to me? <laughs> it's like really good yes. stand-up. What do you say to somebody when you don't want to talk with them? What do you say to someone when you don't want to talk with them? I'm going to cry. What? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. Nacho cheese. It's all tied in. I love talking. So does anyone have any questions? Hi. Oh, I love your ears. Those, Those are so cool. Hi, guys. Sorry. What's your question? How old is Uno? How old is Uno? How old is Uno? Uno's 10 years old. We're all in the... Third and fourth grade. Wow. School. I have a question for you. What grade are you in? What grade are you in? What? First grade. That's so I cool. Did first grade. Oh, she's oh. Oh. Four. First grade. Very smart four year old. You have such Anywhere. maturity. Wow. You're very excited Anyone over here? I'm here. Do you have a question? <laughs> yeah. Do you have a question? <laughs> Do you know? How old were you all, the actors, when you started performing? Brent, start with you. I was actually four years old when I first sang on stage. And he never stopped. <laughs> <laughs> I was six. Um, I didn't start acting until I was like 16, so I was a little bit older. <laughs> awesome. I put on a big budget musical of The Wizard of Oz in my backyard when I was four, involving the entire neighborhood. <laughs> yes, community. I think I was eight when I started. Excellent. I, I was five. All right. Do you guys like to perform? Anyone? Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Well, go for it. It's for sure. <laughs> audition for shows. It's the yeah. best way to make friends. Go for it. Don't listen to anyone who tells you you can't. You got to follow those dreams. Very important. What about over here? You guys have been so awesome. Do you have any questions? Did you enjoy my jokes? Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I will take your silence as a yes. You did. <laughs> Thank you. Everyone. Yeah, thank you. Do you. Who wants to take a photo with the with the we puppets have, and the we have actors? A question in the front. Oh, I have a question. I'm sorry. Sir oh, it's Red. from my friend. Sir Red Google. All right. What do you got? You know, I'm doing the play um from like Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. <gasps> oh, wow. Whoa! Cool. Cool. To get a golden ticket. Yeah. yeah. Whoa! He's doing Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. He's gonna get a golden ticket. That's amazing. Get to 
keep it. Oh, you get to keep it? That's so cool. High five there. Yeah. Congratulations. That's so cool. Oh, that's high up there. <laughs> Any more questions? Yes. Of Oz today. You watch The Wizard of Oz? Today? That's a, today? That's so random. And then he said he did the play. That's the coolest That's news. Good, All right, so if I you got, yes, last question, then we're going to take photos. What happened to the guy with the wheelchair? What happened to the guy with the wheelchair? Anastasia. Why does he have a wheelchair? Why, why does RJ have a wheelchair? Uh, because he has a disability called cerebral palsy, and it just means that. He doesn't have a lot of balance, so his legs work, and he can walk like I can. I can stand up and move around on my own legs, but I can't stand up by myself because I just don't have really good balance, so the chair helps me move long distances, the same like RJ. And just like RJ, I will brag as one of her dear friends, it doesn't stop Anastasia from doing anything. She's a brilliant Georgetown graduate. She. Yes. She's amazing. Yes. Some of you might have seen her on TV giving a primetime speech at the Democratic National Convention for 22 million people. Yes. She is proof that you can do anything you want yeah. and that there are yeah. no barriers. Yeah. And I'm lucky enough that she's my BFF. <laughs> All right, so let's take photos. Yeah. If you want to take a photo, let's line up at the steps and we can take fabulous yeah. photographs. And remember, www.addyanduno.com. Yay! Thank you, guys. Thank you, Google.